Labor issues are causing some shipping ports on the West Coast to close. Officials here in Hawaii say this has happened before and there is no need to panic, though we found some people preparing just in case. Nikki Schenfeld reports. People stopped up on toilet paper, rice, water, and paper towels on Saturday. I heard something from my um, daughter-in-law saying that um, she heard a rumor that there might be some kind of shipping strike or dock strike or what you call those, stevedore strike, something like that. Well, I came they... for something else and then I had forgotten about it. And so um, I saw people in Costco buying toilet paper, paper towel, water. Then I started to panic. So I got my supply too. Others heard the same rumor and did the same. One person comparing Costco YPO to Black Friday, but with plenty of essentials still in stock. On Friday, the Pacific Maritime Association put out a statement saying the ILWU is staging disruptive work actions that have shut down operations at some maritime terminals at the Los Angeles and Long Beach ports. The union is staging similar work that have shut down or severely impacted operations at Oakland, Tacoma, and Seattle ports too. According to Matson, Hawaii, labor slowdowns on the West Coast have impacted some, but not all, terminals. A spokesperson said only one Matson ship had been delayed and will arrive one day later than normal. He added that one ship is discharging cargo in Honolulu on time today, and one is also on schedule to arrive tomorrow. At this point, the latest information we have is Tacoma sailed a couple hours ago out of the port of Tacoma. Um, that's going to triangulate down to the port of Oakland to come to Hawaii, so we won't know whether that ship sails from Oakland to Hawaii until Monday, Tuesday sometime. A West Coast slowdown happened eight years ago. At that time, international shipment was impacted, but shipments here continued. It had very little impact on Hawaii, although we were all kind of uh, sitting at the edges of our seats. During that time, uh, the Obama administration reached out and they worked with the ILWU and all the people there to make sure that Hawaii stayed fed. He says neighbor islands will be most impacted by the shipment delays. A couple of days, it probably won't be so bad. It's just, you know, when you're going into weeks and months, we hope that the shutdown is not going to be very long. Uh, but we also know that because of it, um, probably prices will be going up. No one knows how long the West Coast slowdown will last, but we will know more by the start of the work week. Nikki Schoenfeld, KJON2 News, working for Hawaii.